All right, so what are we doing here? So we're going to look at the 378 NBC Columbus, the mid bunk. Okay. Uh, this is more on your uh, elegant side of the mid bunk fifth wheels. Uh, Columbus is top of the line. Mm -hmm. You know, they don't cut any type of corners when it comes to the product and the manufacturing that they provide. Okay. Uh, that's why they've been around so long. That's why they're so popular. Me. Good so grief. some of the key features I'm going to point out to you here are going to be things that you don't typically see in your everyday fifth wheel and mid bunk. So cool. they, they really do go above and beyond. When it comes to the, the quality of the furniture that they use to the uh, just the different wood and the different you know parts and pieces that they use, you can just tell that it's, it's all high end. Yeah, it's all yeah. high end. And when you walk in for the first time, it, it's one of those campers that you're like, wow, as soon as you walk in. So yeah. I, I'm excited to show it. Awesome. Yeah. We got an outdoor kitchen. We got on an outdoor the, kitchen. I really the, like uh, this outdoor slide. kitchen. Yeah, yeah, the fiberglass outside. What I like about this, I like this griddle. These griddles are awesome and they're easy to clean. So you can just take it right off and spray it down real easy. Yeah. Uh, you know, if you're camping and stuff. So that makes things, life a lot easier for you. Um, when you're out there, got your sink, fridge, everything you need, but you do got a little counter. A lot of times out here on these outside kitchens, they don't provide you no, you know, nowhere to put any of your utensils or anything. They've done mm -hmm. a good job with that, uh, with your LP Connect. If you want to run a little grill out here as well, you can do that uh, right here through the LP hookup, if that's something you choose to do out here all around your outside kitchen. So you kind of got your own little outside kitchen yeah. area. Kind of nice. Great. So. Um, some of the key features over here that they also, and I do like that they put an awning on, on this front slide, mm -hmm. uh, which is really nice. And they don't, they don't put a small one on there, so it'll come all the way out, along with the, the mega awnings here yeah. that we have. This thing covers the whole coach, so you have no lack of entertainment space and staying out of the weather. You know, you're going to have pretty much your whole campers covered with an awning right. from the front side, which is kind of cool. Yeah, you know. that's impressive. Everybody Lots talks of, about these steps. Obviously, these are one of the nicer steps. Everybody's yeah. starting to go to it now. Um, you know, there's saying, still a I've few people these. that are that are still got the ones that fold up in there. But these things, right. you know, everybody talks about them. How sturdy they are. Nice that you can level them if you have a, you know, wherever you're at. You you gotta adjust one little foot enough uh -huh. or whatever. It's kind of nice. But they provide a nice handle too if you little have trouble getting yeah. up and down the steps, and it's helpful. I see that big old pass through. Crazy. Wow. Yeah, That's, you can turn that into a man room if you get in trouble. Yeah, absolutely. So at least you have somewhere to go, right? You got uh -huh. your cable hookup out here too, so it's all good to go. <laughs> right. you, you get in trouble, you got a space, a man. You put a TV in yeah, there, and I'm they've in got here. the hookup right there. Absolutely. So <laughs> huge pass-through stores, like you said. Uh, Six-point auto leveling on here, all push button, all uh, electronic, easy to do. So you're not spending a whole lot of time when you go camping, you know coaches like this you just push a button you get in there and you enjoy life yeah enjoy the weather going out doing whatever you want to do it's awesome. huge yeah um, also generator prep if you come up here this is where that all goes you got a, a nice little area already generator prep for you and there's we don't have it in there today we don't always keep everything in there mm -hmm. obviously you know for security purposes right right solar prep solar wired ready to go as well uh, this coach really has everything on it as far as any type of uh, extras that you are looking for you don't have to ask, it's gonna be on there with the okay. Columbus, so they just go ahead. Let's take a look on the inside. One of the nice things I like about this one, you see a lot of islands, but this one is huge. Like the, the space that you have on there, and uh -huh. you've seen a lot of them yeah. now. So you know, this has a lot of space to work with. Right. So if you have entertaining, uh, you, you've cooked or whatever, you know, you got a lot of places to put, and it's it's got a nice flow of traffic. Right. So and if it's you a have huge, people, I mean, it's a huge sink, and you still have got a the lot farm of space. style sink that everybody likes to talk about. Huge. Uh, these are nice. So if you have hot plates, I don't know if people's been showing any of these, but you can set all that on there. Uh -huh. uh, it makes it real easy. Or even if you're just prepping, you know, right. these are nice as well for prep area uh, if you need the extra space. So very nice. Awesome. Tons of storage in your living space, so if you needed to put some extra blankets or things up out of the way or whatever it is that you take with you that is important to you, you know, you can put it up there. But if you look at the quality of furniture, you can tell that 
you know, it's real wood that uh -huh. they use in here. It's not the cheap oh, yeah. pressed stuff. If you look at the hinges within, it's like you see in your house. It's not the cheap little screw hinges. It's really quality when it comes to it. And you can feel it, mm -hmm. you know. It, it It's something that you it's know. Sturdy. Gonna, yeah, it ain't going to be... 100 times using it, it ain't gonna get worn out real yeah. easy. And with camping, how, how, I mean, people are rough on things. Yeah. So let's just be honest. So, you know, one thing I do like about them is that you can you can be rough and you can camp. Yeah. And not have to worry about, well, let me take care of things. Really. Right. You know, no, that's right. not. Right. Huge window right here in your living space for natural lighting, as well as in the eating area. They have a great space here for you if you're just gonna have your coffee in the morning to look out. Nice big window here for you. Mm -hmm fireplace huge entertainment center here for you with uh we don't always keep yeah this moves so if you want to yeah the back st storage area where yeah. people like to hide stuff but the cool thing you do you can put your videos back here uh -huh. nice little space whatever you know you, you don't want looking cluttered you like to be a neat right. organized ocd type yep. person you can put it all back behind your tv nobody's even going to see it Nice little feature that they have there. I think there's a couple other ones that do stuff like that too. So uh, I think that's pretty cool. That's nice. Um, huge Fury and Fireplace, 40 incher. Puts out enough heat to cool it off in a full fall day. I when when we first started this uh, these tours, first one was in April, mm -hmm. and even in April, for some reason it was cold that day, and we they had were. these on, and they they warm it up pre pretty quick. You know, I get a lot of questions. They say, oh, you know, fireplace in a camper, whatever. Yeah. That sounds crazy when they first start looking at right. it. And, you know, now people get to see them being worked because they're more, you know, fluently seen yeah. now than yeah. when they first start putting them in here. But, but they work, you know. You're not going to heat your coach on a winter day. Right. You know, but you, you can sit in it'll, here with it be cold and it'll warm you up. Yeah, yeah it's, it's awesome. nice. Yeah. I remember as a kid, we had the, the um, like the on the edge of the wall, the furnace, the, the little, I can't think what I'm talking about, but it was like that. The heat came from the Oh, yeah, the register. Yeah, yeah, the, the floor, register. That's yeah, what I'm floor, thinking. Yeah. And I can remember as a kid, like, watching TV and they got putting hot. under a blanket. Yeah. Don't you, touch it. Right. <laughs> get your feet close to it. Yeah. But that would just warm you up. And imagine putting a, a little, small little uh, air mattress here. And, and there's the room for that. Are watch, yeah, plenty of room. Everybody can watch a kids movie. Kids are watching. Yeah. They're warm. That turns you know? out into a bed yeah. for you. So there's a lot of space here. Yeah. And full size refrigerator. This is the same size as in my house, I think. So you know. Yeah. You yeah. got a nice full size. A lot of people like to see the inside. It's as big as your house fridge. Well, for most people, you know. Nice size, full residential refrigerator. But I like their ovens a lot better than a lot of people. It's a full size oven. Yeah. Here. Uh, you can cook basically anything you want in it. Yep. In this oven, uh, it is a three burner top, which is nice. You do have a window here, which is nice for extra venting with a slide. Okay. So that's kind of nice. Not yeah. all of them have that around the stove area. With my I kinda, cooking, it's nice to have a. Definitely mine too. Yeah. <laughs> I do like that. But with your vent and everything, full size microwave as well. Um, it's tons of storage over here. I know you can't see it from over there, but look at all these drawers that you got here you know to put whatever you need to you got plenty of space yeah they i mean they just look at all the space under there you can put you know for your cleaning supplies whatever you need just out of the way where nobody's gonna see it but they also have a bunch of outlets to be used which is kind of nice uh, this is kind of a nifty little handy deal there too uh -huh. this kind of comes up you got your charging port for your phone uh, your outlets, if you need to plug in a crock pot, air fart, whatever it is that you need to use. Right. Uh, if you're entertaining guests, it's nice that, that they have that little feature there. Yeah, it's awesome. awesome. One of the more popular features is the mid bunk. This is this is a cool little room. Yeah. The light. There, yeah, there, you, there go. you go. So I like this for a lot of reasons. You know, now I'm getting a lot of questions in these mid bunks and, and just the bunk houses in general. Like, okay, you know, we got kids, but we might want to use it as an office or uh -huh. whatever. This one is kind of set up perfect for that. Not only can you watch TV and it has everything ready to go, or if you wanted to live in here because this bunk comes down, this one turns into a bed, but some people nowadays are traveling and, and working you know, remote. So yeah. this provides that nice little area to have a desk or if you just want to put your laptop and kind of to work out of here, you could turn this into an office area if you yeah. didn't want to use it as a mid bunk, which is nice for a lot of people. Mm -hmm. Huge wardrobe on the side. If you did have kids in here, plenty of places to put their clothes with the hangers and everything already built in for you uh, automatically. Nice little dressers if you want to put the clothes in there. 
plenty of sport storage down in here with the nice little shelf to put things. Uh, so if you did kind of use this as an office area, you got a place for your router, whatever you need right. to put down there, your files or whatever that you utilize. Uh, that's a nice space to be able to put that there as well. You got, you got school age kids. They're going to dig this space. Well, they're going to love it, you know, yeah. or even just a, a teenager. Yeah. He's got his own little place, yep. you know, it's like his own little studio yeah. apartment. Right. And, you know, he's rocking and while mom and dad are out there enjoying life, they right. can come back here and, you know, hang out. Give us so, privacy. Yeah. yeah. I know you guys have seen these come down. This is just the bed that comes on down. You want to help me on that one? Yep. Sure, there there you go. And then you do got a nice window in here as yeah. well awesome. with the slider. So you can open it up and get a nice little breeze in here. That's sweet. Mm-hmm. Very nice. Very cool. Very cool mid bunk here. The door, the space saving door there. Yeah, that's kind of neat, right? Look. Yeah. It is. pretty awesome. At first I was like, why do they do that like that? Uh -huh. I was like, I don't know if I like it, but it works perfect. Right. At first I didn't really know what to think about it, but now I like it because it, it does work good. Yeah. How, how it's feasible uh, for access to walk in there and it's not opening in there, but it's not opening out here either. So that, yeah. that is nice. Yeah. Yep. Tons of pantry room. For you to put whatever you might need as far as groceries your cereal whatever it is yep. that you bring with you macaroni and cheese whatever right. your kids eat at the time uh, nice space for, to be able to yeah. utilize for that as well so much space oh yeah control panel control panel is all hidden a lot of people like that so it's not an eyesore mm -hmm. sticking out yep. uh, they do a good job of putting that in an isolated area but also they have a uh, coat rack in here so when you come in you got the coat rack area right when you walk in. Yep. So if you do have guests for yourself or whatnot, um, that's nice as well. Another little bunk area. Then you know what else is nice people don't think about? Uh -huh. Not these. Uh huh. Not everybody has that. Right. Coming up some of these stairs. And for some people, if you have a hard time coming up and down stairs. Those are very helpful. And th this one, it's on there. I've you seen know, people it's very fall helpful. down steps before. Right. And Today, I mean, actually. Yeah, uh, well, I've had people say, well, why don't they put something here? Well, Columbus knows and recognizes those things. It's the small things that they do and think about for yeah. people for comfort of living in these. You know, that's the small things that I talk about with uh, campers that really set themselves aside opposed to their competitors. Right. It's yep. just the small things they think about for their people. That's awesome. Mm -hmm. Then you got your loft area. You know, some people use this for extra storage, mm -hmm. um, but you know, it is able to be utilized if you needed to for extra sleeping. Cool. Yeah, oh yeah, I love it. You know, my kids would get it. Oh they, yeah. Well, they come and play in the campers sometimes. Right. They, they love this stuff. They think <laughs> well, it's the coolest thing in the world. I mean, these, yeah, they, these, when they first saw something like this, they were like, oh, that's awesome. That's what, I know. feel like they, they'd be torn between that cool mid bunk room and this, like where do it I want to be? Yeah, Here, this, this is, is cool. super cool. Or that, it is yeah. cool. Gotcha. Yep. Very cool. Um, before we look at the bathroom, we'll come into the to the bedroom area. I really like this bedroom. You know, you got your TV that'll go here with the bracker, but they give you actually full size dresser drawers in these, if you can see, uh, to put your clothes. Mm -hmm. Some of them are just, oh yeah, we got a dresser, but yeah. what do you really? You can put a sweatshirt in there. Right. <laughs> <laughs> this you can I've actually, yeah, these you can actually use and they're functional. Yeah, they're really nice. So, plenty of room. Yeah, plenty of room. Uh, full size bed here queen size bed in here but in here i absolutely this is what a lot of people love wow. the shelves for your shoes is awesome i'm gonna let you get in there so you can show them a picture of that and then on the other side it's washer and dryer prepped all the mirrors is nice mm -hmm. for getting ready in the morning uh, or whatever you're gonna do i like the mirrors but even better i like this one how this is too with the mirror on the, yeah. the pocket door see that yep very nice. I like the pocket door idea that they put in here opposed to a regular door. Just saves you on taking up some extra space that you might be able to use to live in. Yeah. Doesn't get in the way. Um, but also you can get around your whole bed if you need to. Awesome. Yeah, people love that. Very cool. Lots of storage. Space. Lots of storage underneath. Extra chairs. Yep, extra chairs for your table when you pull up the leaf at the bottom back over there. Mm -hmm. uh, for If you have some cast over, if you have a bigger family and you need it, you got your extra chairs as well. Perfect. Mm -hmm. Awesome. So something like this, you, you can get around $52,620. Wow. Right, yeah. Um, it's crazy. Payment right around $405 a month. Roughly, you know. Right. Uh, just a wonderful area to, to spend time with your family. They do a really good job yeah. here. Uh, I, I just like the nice accent features that they have. Just the trim molding as well. 
I think that it's really nice. Mm -hmm. It's it's more like an elegant home yeah. than, than anything else. I mean, the dark, the dark wood just screams classy. That's yeah. You know, that's what I like about Columbus. Yeah. I always know when I'm gonna if I have customers coming here uh, to our area to come mm -hmm. and see these things, which they do come from everywhere. I right. had a guy come from Indiana the other day about one, um, but I love showing Columbus because I just know. Uh, I'm not going to get a beat up and a bunch of questions. And qu they're just going to be like, oh, my gosh. Yeah. You know, so. 